Hey guys, welcome back. It's Tuesday. <laughs> I don't know why I was showing you that, she just handed it to me. It feels like it's been a while because I didn't like, you know, weekly, well I kind of did weekly vlog last week but obviously that was on my main channel because um, we were in Paris. Um, the trip was so nice, it was, I just love Paris so much. Yeah, today we're having a little day with Indy, aren't we little bub? And this bloody vlog, vlog camera is falling apart, like, so it has a flip up screen and the, the bit that holds the flip up screen keeps just falling back again. <laughs> Oh my god, and I just got this camera and they're so bloody expensive and I can't I've only had this camera for Not long maybe like a month or two. I don't know. Anyway <laughs> Camera problems. Are you in your car? Are you in your car? Right, we're gonna go out. I'm gonna take her to um, At my gym they have we go to a David Lloyd and they have um, a little play area for kids so um yeah, so I'm gonna take her there for an hour or two and then we're gonna go out. We're gonna go to St Albans because it's not too far from here. And there's a few bits and bobs that I need to get in town and I wanna develop my film um, from over the last few weeks. <laughs> You're having a little chat as well. Can you say bye bye? Bye bye. Yeah, <laughs> she's getting it slowly. She says bye bye. But I think because of the, ca I've got the camera on, bye. and she probably knows that I'm like, bye. she can probably tell when I'm filming. Or you know, she doesn't know that it's filming, but she knows that I'm doing something um, different. Oh hey Frank. <laughs> like if she's in front of people, she doesn't tend to say the words as quickly because I don't know if it's shyness. Bye. Or... Yeah, he's saying hello. You want to vlog? Okay, go on then. Got a bit of lunch, haven't we? Oh no, sit down. <laughs> Time might be easier. That's it. <laughs> just under the floor. Like just on it really. Yeah. <laughs> so I've gone with this design. It's so pretty. Touches of gold. And here are the other ones. I was going to get this one because it has hearts. What's your perfume? I'm on my way to go meet Mary now and I'm so excited, I'm so hungry. <laughs> We're going to the Good Egg. Yeah, and if they do need any help. <laughs> hey! <laughs> We've got our shakshuka. We're having a little chat. It's so cool in here. <laughs> I know. And we got some halloumi in there as well. Got a flat white. So pretty. Hey guys, I hope you're all well. I just wanted to have a little bit of a chat and a bit of a catch up and kind of explain what's been going on this week because I've just been so bad at vlogging this week. I think I just need to get back into the rhythm. So yesterday I got a little bit of footage but not much so I just thought I'd like chat through it because it, um, I don't know if it'll make a bit more sense than me just showing you random bits of footage. It was so exciting. So I went up to dry by. I went and I was one of the first people to try out Alexand sorry, Alessandra Steinhers. I tried out her new bride line of um, nail designs so look oh my god aren't they pretty this design is called the I think the bridesmaid it was really nice it was nice to have a bit of a pamper and um, yeah they're so nice in there in dry by it's they're so like friendly and then after that I went to go and meet Mary love her so much she's such a breath of fresh air like especially on YouTube she's just so like down to earth and we were just chatting for ages. We went to a place called The Good Egg. And oh my God, it was so good. I got, we both got the shakshuka, came home, and then, you know, had my usual like afternoon with Indy. Yeah, just chilled out. Uh, at the moment, I'm on Netflix. I'm watching The Keepers, um, which I'm so late to. Loads of people, like, you know, told me to watch it ages ago, and I didn't for some reason. I think I was scared to watch it because <laughs> The, the picture for, for it on Netflix looks so creepy, like the nun with the burnt out like face. And I think it just put me off because I thought it would be really, really creepy, but it's actually just about like 
them trying to solve the murder of this nun. Oh, also we're watching Love. I think it's, is it season two or season three? But anyway, we're watching the new one. I, please excuse me, because I haven't done like my hair and makeup today. I've been to the gym this morning and I've had a Gymshark delivery come. Last, no, was it last night? Night before last, I ordered, oh, it's so soft. I ordered some bits from Gymshark because I'm like back on my gym grind, so I'm trying to be. You know when you're wearing stuff in the gym that you just don't feel nice in? And I was like, I just feel a bit shit. <laughs> so I was like, I kind of looked at my gym drobe and I was like, oh, I really want some new bits. So um, I got this, this is like a, it's like a really high neck, like a tunnel neck um, cropped jumper. It's probably not gonna look great just holding it up, but oh my God, it's so soft. I haven't tried it on yet. But I just thought this is perfect because I never know what to like um, throw on on top of me when I go to when I'm going to the gym. And then I also got um, a kind of like a two piece. So this purple pair of leggings, which I've seen I've seen so much on Instagram and they look amazing on everyone. So I'm hoping they they'll look good on me. Um, and then I got the the top part. I love this, it looks so comfortable. I got everything in a size small. Paris was so nice last week. I really hope you guys liked the vlog. Thank you for all of your comments as well. Um, I'm thinking of doing a segment each week of like answering a few of your questions, just so it's a bit more of like a back and forth instead of me just, you know, telling you just about my week. No, let me know if you'd like me to do that. Like it's always nice to answer your questions and just feel like I'm connecting with you guys. Oh my God, and another thing I wanted to say. So I started, um, kind of like my own hashtags because I just think it's a fun way of like collecting all of my images together and everything especially on Instagram so when I travel I'm, tra I'm gonna be hashtagging everything Sammy's travel diaries and in style posts and things I'm gonna be hashtagging Sammy's style diaries if you guys ever buy things from like my haul videos or anything or if you're ever inspired by outfits I've put together that you've like then tried out um, and then if you ever post them onto Instagram you can always use my style hashtag as well because then that means that I'll see it I can you know like sh um, share it on my insta stories if you do it'll be really nice to make us all feel a bit closer like, I don't get to see or and meet so many of you guys and it's like you guys get to watch me which is <laughs> which is great <laughs> But um, I just mean it's nice to have like some back and forth and oh my god please recommend me any other podcasts that you love and let me know what they talk about in those podcasts because I'm literally, I, I, all I do now is like I drive, I drive with podcasts on, I walk around the house with podcasts on, I cook with podcasts on, I get annoyed when... <laughs> when I have to like stop my podcast and talk to someone that's how bad it's got <laughs> oh my god it's so funny I'm always like oh I'm fine and like pause <laughs> but um let me know your favorite podcasts and with that I'm gonna go for now bye <laughs> Indy, you enjoying your new kitchen? I can turn the heat up, look. <laughs> the weather is horrible. I just want to go home already. Oh my God, it's pissing it down. But I'm going for a meeting and then I've got to get um, Noah, my little nephew, a little Christmas present. So yeah, that's my... They're my things for today. So I popped into H&M Home because I love it. Any chance I get to come in here? <laughs> um, I might get this pillow cushion cover. And I'm just looking for some other bits as well. Bits and bobs, you know. Morning guys, it's Thursday and I'm just about to head out. Um, I'll like catch you guys up later. Um, I thought I'd show you like the base of my outfit. I'm wearing this jumper, it's from Weekday. My necklace is, is Misoma, straight leg, top shop jeans. Um, and my shoes are like Ganny shoes from ages ago. So basically today, I'm so excited. I'm going to the peel boutique and um, I'm gonna be getting my first chemical peel. And I've wanted one for so long. I've always been so interested in them. So um, yeah, I'm gonna take you along and like let you know the results. While we're here, I can give you a little before of my skin. So 
Um, I have to leave for the train in a minute, but um, so the reason I want one is that I always have like I've got a lot of discoloration, I've always had a lot of scarring, like you can see it here, you know, like I just get scarring from spots so often kind of here it's like some old scarring and I don't know which one I'm gonna get yet I think I'm gonna get there and they're gonna talk to me about like what one will probably be probably be best for me so I'm just walking up to Daniel Galvin in Marlebone um, which is where this pill boutique is because I think there are a few of them Hey guys, so I've just got back home and I've just thought I'd come to the same spot that I showed you my before um, before the peel um, so that you can see the kind of like the effect straight afterwards. Why do I always film after I run up the stairs? I'm so happy with the results like at the moment and I've literally just got in so I haven't been able to like, you know, sit in front of a mirror and like meticulously look at every detail. I met the founder of the Peel Boutique um, she's called Rabia and she was so lovely. She was telling me about the brand, the philosophy behind it and everything and um, it was so interesting. I loved just hearing her talk about the Peel Boutique and just hearing it from the horse's mouth as well. It was so nice. I'd love to go to her actual clinic and she said we maybe we could do that in the future. But anyway, so I was booked in for the brightening peel um, and these are all, these are with lactic acid, uh, it's like with natural ingredients, with fruit enzymes and things. Anyway, she asked me about my concerns though, and mine, as I was saying earlier, was like my scarring and things, and like, you know, I said that I have breakouts and things, so she was like, okay, so we'll do the blemish pill for you. So I was like, okay, and it was so nice. It went so quickly. And she also did an under eye, uh, like bright um, blemish or brightening mask, <laughs> um, which I think has actually, well, I can see the difference here. It's really cool, uh, really nice to chat to her and um, I won't go on and on <laughs> but like I can see, I can definitely see a difference in my skin like a bit like the clarity here and obviously that's only from going once and it's just a 20 minute session. Uh, I would love to like work on my skin a bit more and then try and you know brighten up here like under the mouth and um, you know these you know spots here but they're a lot deeper and it was nice to start with something a little bit like you know something not too heavy just to see how my skin would react to it as well because I'd never had a peel before this week I was planning to vlog all week and I caught Jason's bug um kind of like late last week so I just haven't been myself this week and I, I just haven't had any energy and I just I've had to cancel a few things as well because I just haven't been that well so I didn't really feel like vlogging obviously and I feel like I've been going through a bit of a weird patch like with just sometimes I think it happens like when you're on social media and on the you know you put yourself out there a lot um I feel like every now and then it I kind of have a just a weird patch with it and just a bit of like a disconnect yeah I'm hoping I'll feel like more like myself again soon um but yeah I feel a little bit better today I think I'm gonna try and get to the gym um because I am working on my glutes my aim right now is to gain and I'm so excited about this because it's like a new fitness journey for me um so yeah I'm trying to grow a bootay because <laughs> it is not there right now this is what we're working with right now like mm, bit flat bit flat isn't it I mean I'm not wearing flattering jeans but yeah so I'm gonna try and work on that Hello lovely people. Oh my god, I, I had such a good workout at the gym. I really pushed myself and I'm just trying to build up like a good inspiration. Good people to go to for inspiration. So I've been I've been watching Megan Grubb. Is it? I hope I'm saying her name right. But her video is on YouTube because I follow her on Instagram. And then I realised that she makes videos and oh my god, her body is just insane. And she's so, so sweet as well. Like she seems like the sweetest person. So anyway, I'll link her down below if you, um, like she vlogs, but like she talks about fitness, but she also just does like, you know, kind of like normal vlogs. She does like what I eat in a day videos. So it's, all, it's really good to see what, people eat to like gain muscle and she's really like down to earth you know like she she eats normal stuff it's not stuff that you can't find anywhere um i'm so rambly in this vlog um, i'm just making some dinner i'm making some i'm gonna have some kale some quinoa and some sea bass i'll show you guys how my dinner turns out i think i need to be eating much more though i think that's something i'm gonna struggle with with trying to gain muscle like i'm so used to eating like kind of smallish portions 
so I think I definitely need to add more like carbs into my diet and stuff anyway bye this is Megan by the way so oh <laughs> that's not her that's her dog and cat and literally they are everything to me so Bluebell's here right now and Bluebell is very young and she look at her bum the sweetest little dog oh it's she amazing <laughs> Okay, this is my dinner, but sea bass has kind of, split, you know, like flaked up a little bit, but it's fine. Um, yeah, so quinoa, sea bass, um, some kale, and if I'm hungry after, I'll probably have something else. <laughs> but um, this is it for now.